know, Sarah, one question about your, your soap days. One thing a lot of soap actors did were appear at shopping malls. Now, is that something that you ever did, the big shopping mall appearances? You have something that you're hiding, that you're getting to at this, so I'm just going to go, uh, did I ever do shopping malls? I don't think I've actually ever did shopping right. malls, though, did I? I think I did at Kmart, though. All right. Now, Why? How, what do you have? Oh, no, no. Just, uh, I was wondering, how surreal is that for an actor to appear in that type of venue? It was a very, very long time ago. Um, I only did one or two of those. I was very young, and I was, I was still in school, so I didn't have much time. I think I maybe did one or two autograph signing sessions. Okay. Well, we'll turn to this movie, The Wardrobe. Love The Wardrobe. Thank you. Cool outfits. How much thought went into what you were going to wear? Denise Wingate is an unbelievable costume designer. A lot of those outfits were constructed from scratch. Um, the, the corset was made from scratch. All the, um, the night, all the lingerie <coughs> was made from trashy lingerie in Los Angeles. Um, hair, makeup, and wardrobe. I was very lucky because it was very, very, very important to the character to have those sleek lines. But believe me, I couldn't sit. <laughs> I could barely walk by the end of the day in those outfits. Now, the movie, very edgy. Now, when you were reading the script, did some people say, you know, I don't know if this is right for you. This is really, really out there. Well, there were certain people in my camp who were a little nervous. I think probably Joss Whedon being the, the one who was the most had is hesitant about it. Um, but everyone saw the determination that I had to do it and the want, and everyone knew that I was going to do it, and that was it. Now, how, how do you think the Buffy fans will react uh, when, when this comes out? Well, I think they have to, you know, remember that I'm an actress, and they're all characters that I play, that I'm not Buffy either. I'm certainly not Catherine. Um, but I think, it, I think they'll enjoy it. I think if you enjoy the show, you will enjoy the movie. Now, your character seems to enjoy playing head games in this movie. Uh, and I've heard that people in Hollywood sometimes, <coughs> sometimes play head games, too. Now, even in the business a while, how adept have you become at reading people and when people are trying to snow you? I'd like to say that I can catch it, but I'm still pretty naive when it comes to stuff like that. You know, I believe people say things because they mean them. Now, you know, question, a lot of actors in TV shows uh, that are on right now are making the transition to movies. Do you find that doing a series like Buffy that's opening a lot of doors for actors your age? Oh, absolutely. You know, like anything, it opens and it closes. Helen Hunt did a wonderful thing. She won the Oscar and she still stayed. And I think it's incredible, and I always were surprised that movies didn't jump on using television actors because there's a built-in audience there. Not everyone goes to the movies on a Saturday night, but everyone has television in their homes. Um, on the other hand, of course, it puts you out there so much that there will be times where you do fight it, where people see you as this character, and, and you do have to fight that type. Okay. Now, with this movie, were there ever any scenes that caused you any problems that were just a little bit, a little bit hard to shoot for you? Oh, lots of it were hard to shoot. I mean, even just tor even the simple ones of just torturing Selma, I don't, I don't enjoy that. But it was the character. And sometimes Roger had to give us a little bit of a shove to go out there and do it. And did you find that the crew members, uh, after some of those scenes, were staying away from you after, uh, after a take? No, but they did enjoy them. You'd hear a lot of laughter, and sometimes you could see a little snickering behind the set. Perfect. Great. Exactly <laughs> Thank you. Oh, my Thanks God. I was about to start choking. Great.